Hi everyone, this is Dr. Jyoti Bala. I welcome you all on my YouTube channel. I hope you all are doing great. In this session, we will be exploring and discussing about Chem Informatics and its application and some of the useful resources, databases and tools which you can use for your drug designing, pharma, chemistry and bioinformatics research projects. So let's get started. Chem Informatics is basically the application of informatics techniques to study the chemistry. Chem Informatics is a combination of chemistry and informatics. Here, you utilize informatics techniques to study chemistry. It involves the use of computational tools and techniques to process and analyze, visualize chemical data and information. Chem Informatics plays a crucial role in designing, synthesis and optimization of new chemicals and materials. So let's explore what are the application of chem informatics. One of the main application of chem informatics is in the field of drug discovery and development. Chem informatics can be used to design and synthesize new drug candidate. It can also be utilized to predict properties and interactions also for the optimization of their efficiency and safety. This can lead to the development of more effective or personalized medicine for variety of diseases. Apart from drug designing, chem informatics is also used in the field of material science where it can be used to design and optimize new material for a variety of applications such as energy storage, generation, electronic and construction. Additionally, chem informatics could be utilized in the areas of environmental science where it can be used to predict the fate of a behavior of a chemical in environment and to design and optimize environmentally friendly chemicals and material. Overall, chem informatics is a powerful and versatile field with many applications in chemical and material industry along with the pharma and drug sector. Now let's explore some of the top resources, tools and databases which can be utilized in chem informatics. The number one database is PubChem. It's a NCBI based database which has information about chemical compound, their properties and biological activity. If you want to explore this database, you can watch our previous tutorial where we have shown the practical demonstration how you can utilize PubChem. Uh, the another tool is ChemSpider. It's a search engine for chemical compound to look for their properties. On third is uh, Campbell. It's an AMBL based database which gives you ideas about chemical properties as biological activities. They also give you ideas about target proteins and specifically could be utilized for your drug designing and development experiment. The another database is Zinc database which is commercially available for the compounds for virtual screening. You may also explore Chem Exxon. It's a suit. This platform gives you information about the tools for the analysis, visualization, and prediction of the chemical data. You may also explore Pipeline Pilot, a platform for the analysis and visualization of chemical and biological data. Whereas CDK provides you a library of chem informatics tools for the analysis and visualization of chemical data at one platform. You may also explore Open Babel, which provides you a library of chem informatics tools, especially for the conversion and manipulation of chemical data, especially if you want to change the file format. You can also use Chem Doodle. This also provides visualization analysis tools, whereas OpenAI scientific software provides you additional features for the analysis and visualization of chemical data. Apart from these platforms, you may also try these uh, additional tools. I hope you have liked the session and you are going to explore them further. If you have any queries using these tools and resources, you can contact us. We also provide training in such areas. We are open for training research collaborations, so do contact us.